Now, this is the moment where usually I would have some sort of film quote. But recently I've been watching the newer Star Wars movies and there's like no memorable quotes from these movies. The closest I've got is um, from Solo. I've got a really good feeling about this. But it's just... A bit crap. Hello Mother Funsters and welcome to the stream. My name is Mella and today we are going to be playing some Skyrim. Yes! It's better fucking work this time. It doesn't work on the big face screen, does it? I meant to fix this! <laughs> Alright, one more time. There it is. Thank you so much for the resub, Arctic. You utter legend. I really appreciate you, dude. Um, you actually, I've seen you stream a couple of times recently, I believe, so I'm going to shout you out. There you go. Stardew Valley as well. Mm. Very sexy. How did that go? I'm guessing you were playing with Moon and friends. That sounds like fun, my dude. How's everyone doing today? I hope you're all having a really nice week. Um, it's another one that's just zoomed by for me. Disappeared in a, in a blink of an eye. I can't believe it's Thursday already. I really can't. Um, still, it's all good. Uh, we've got Saturday stream uh, coming up, uh, obviously, on Saturday, uh, which I'm really going like, looking forward to. It's obviously Final Fantasy X-2, and it's going to be our last Saturday stream um, because the uh, the wife's going back to work, so uh, it's, it's basically time to... Uh, to sort of, you know, knuckle down and all that kind of thing. I was going to stream today, but I got distracted. Mm. Was it because of Moon's uh, birthday stream? Because I can understand that. Uh, so, yeah, no more Saturday streams, probably. Um, and the Thursday streams are going to be changed to Friday streams. But the Friday streams are going to be longer, hopefully. The idea, uh, as it stands at the moment, we haven't completely 100% um, decided, but the idea is that the Friday streams will be six hours long, every week um, and no more Saturday streams so that actually means that my overall um, like hours per week only goes down by an hour on average because at the moment with four four hours every Thursday and six hours every other Saturday it's seven hours um, average per week um, so obviously six hours every week uh, just on the same day means that we're only going down by one hour average per week but what I'm kind of hoping is um, that um, when once once we kind of figure out the um, the ho how the whole routine works, there might be like little gaps where um, uh, T's asleep, like having a nap, where I might be able to stream for like two to three hours at a time, and that may be uh, potentially up to three times a week. So we're going to see how that goes. Um, but um, for now, the idea is going to be I'm going to pause my Final Fantasy um, playthrough until I figure things out, uh, and we're going to be continuing Skyrim, and Skyrim is going to be the Friday um, the Friday stream. That's the idea. That's uh, that's how we're uh, how we're planning things at the moment, at least. We'll see how it goes. But yeah, I, um, that's this, that's actually technically my announcement. This is the first time I've I've mentioned it to anyone apart from Virtue and Warden Mori. Who, um, Morden Mori, for anyone who doesn't know, is uh, the uh, other mod that I mod with with Vert. Um, just purely because it was uh, it was quite pertinent conversation that we were having uh, about some future streams. But yes, now it's out there. It's in the ether. Everyone knows. I don't know how many people actually care. Um, oh, actually, Susie's sort of half aware um, uh, about what I've just like about half of what I've just mentioned as well. Um, maybe slightly more. You get the idea. Anyway, so. What do we reckon about getting into some Skyrim? Rub some, I'll rub the hands together. I reckon we should do it. We should definitely get ourselves into the good, the good book, like the good, the good game, the good book. <laughs> um, so cut the, cut the music, cut the music. Let's just. Okay. <laughs> we haven't got technical difficulties. I just think that's funny. Um, I, I actually kind of, it's, it's one of those ridiculous things where I made that thing in, but in the hope that I never actually need it because it's literally for technical difficulties. But the sound is going to go. 
It always does. Sorry, I'm just uh, entertaining myself at the moment because uh, it's um, it's the time where the sound normally goes a bit odd. And it's actually for a longer period of time than I originally thought. Um, I, I watched my VODs to, um, not all of them, like all of everything, but uh, I watched quite a bit just to ensure quality because it's important to me. Um, but you got some pizza. <gasps> what kind of pizza? I need to know everything. Why Why is the game not capturing? There we go. It took a while, but it's working now. Pepperoni. Oh, just pepperoni, nothing else? Hold on. That is all. It's um, a little bit on the vibe. Oh, for goodness sake. But um, all the moments at the end of the day is that you enjoy it. It was a frozen pizza. Fantastic. That actually does sound quite nice. I had a really nice um, frozen pizza the other day. It was deep, deep pan. Uh, which is weird because normally I'm not big on deep pan, but it was really good and it was like all the meat sort of meaty pizza But it was it was only a pound from Iceland um, Iceland the shop obviously not the country um, and It was yeah, it was really good Right now I did One I, what I meant to do I meant to between streams. I meant to do some alchemy Um because it does kind of need to be done. Uh, problem, though, is... Alright, just calm down, lady. Uh, the problem with that is um, that I basically haven't had time. Um, I've been uh, playing uh, a seed, a personal seed of Ocarina of Time Randomizer. Uh, I called it a hell seed because it, uh, it was key sanity, requires all medallions, but also um, full entrance randomizer as well. Uh, it was really good fun, uh, but also um, this game, I mean, you guys kind of know from the way that I play it um, and how it just interrupts the stream when I turn it on and off, but it doesn't lend itself to multitasking at all. So if I'm going to do something in it, it requires my full attention, so I just haven't had time. So, I'll have that, thank you. Um... We need to travel back to town to put our stuff away. I might do just a few minutes, a few minutes of um, alchemy at the beginning of the game. Just, you know. Ah, that looks like it might be worth taking and selling. Um, but yeah, uh, we'll see. Um, where's that lass? I want to find that lass, that weird lass. Um, so I can sell to her. She should be around... She's around the dogs, isn't she? Or is she around the trolls? I can't remember. I always get lost in the holdfasts. She should be around here, I think. Oh, what's this? To drop dead fools. That's a place I don't think we've actually been yet. Um, let's have a quick look around. She sh I think she should be through this door. No, that's a staircase. Mala. Um, like, oh, um, she's around somewhere. I mean, I know that's not very helpful. Oh, come on, lass. Ah, oh, now, hold on. Was she... I think she was in here last time we saw her. Is that... That's not her. What time of day is it? Hold on. Okay, she definitely should be around here somewhere. There she is. Yeah, all right. All right. Well, that's kind of why I came here. That's why I'm here. Uh, what was it I picked up? It was the necklace, wasn't it? How much gold does she have? She has a decent amount of gold, actually. I mean, it's not worth as much with her, but... Still worth a decent amount. If I have not got enough gold, I really don't. You can get more bolts. I think, to be honest, I've probably got enough bolts now. I've got 130 odds. Um, I mean, we could stop by one last time, I guess, just to... Uh, just to get um, what's been shot for the last few moments while we've been uh, faffing a boot. Um, I think I've gone the wrong way though, haven't I? Oh no, it is this way. I mean, at least it means I'm getting roughly the hang of where we're going around here. Right, here we go. 
I mean, that is quite satisfying apart from anything else. It's, uh, it's like cleaning something in a game. Like, I did think, um, there's that game that I've seen a few people play, um, uh, what's it called? Um, it's called House Flipper. And it looks super satisfying because you, you, one of the things that you do is you basically go in into a, a, a rundown house and clean and fix things. And it looks super satisfying. It looks like such a chill game, actually. I, I, I wouldn't mind playing it someday. Right, hopefully we can fast travel from up here. Uh, I want to go back to White Run. If I can find it. Uh, there we go. There used to be an exploit where you could pickpocket guards and give them better arrows. So when they shoot at a dummy, they shoot those arrows. <laughs> That's cool. But I mean, how, how is that useful? I mean, if you've pickpocketed them, then you could get more of the... Oh, I see. Oh, that's really cool. I'm, I'm guessing when you say they used to be an exploit, I'm guessing they've got rid of it. I'm not afraid of you, you know. Even... Yeah, you're not afraid of me, are you? Then why are you walking away from me? Little shit. Get a haircut. <laughs> as far as I know, it's gone. Well, I did purposefully install... Uh... <laughs> I did purposefully install um, the, uh, the patch, so... <laughs> Hello. It's a shame, isn't it? Stormcloak's uprising. The Gilded Green, yes. It's a bit of an eyesore at the moment. More of a problem for the pilgrims than for me, but not many of them around anymore. <laughs> To the east of here is a hidden grove where the Elder Gleam resides. It's the oldest living thing in Skyrim, maybe all of Tamriel. Our tree here in the city was grown from a cutting of that tree. You can still feel the glory of the mother tree through it. Even its name is an echo. Okay, well, um, that sounds very Lord of the Rings-ish. You know, the white tree of um, Minas Tirith. I've thought about that. Is uh, originally a never really die. They an acorn of one of the world trees or something. From the parents, I can't remember what the name of it is. Its child. But even if you could get to the Elder Gleam, you couldn't tap it. Not with any normal metal. I'd tap that. Um, Elder Gleam is older than metal, from a time before men or elves. Hmm. Even affect it, you have to tap into the old magic. You'll have to deal with the Hagravens. I've heard about a weapon they've made for sacrificing Spriggans. It's called Nettlebane. The Hags terrify me, or I would have gone after it myself. Your spirit is strong. Kinareth's winds will guide your path. It's held in a Hagraven nest called Orphan Rock. Okay, well, we're not doing that right now, but we've got, you know... I have just turned into a pear bird. What? I can feel another one coming as well. Um, yeah. Um, in the lore of um, Lord of the Rings, um, like back in the ancient times, the the, the before the sun and the moon existed, um, there were these two trees that created all light. Um, on Arda. Um, which is the name of the world, I believe, if I remember rightly. Uh, and then um, the bad guy, Morgoth, and Shelob's um, parent, uh, Ungoliant, destroyed them. Is that right? I feel like I might be getting my wires crossed. I, I think that's right. Anyway, I don't think anyone cares. Um, right, I did say that we were actually were going to do some um, alchemy, didn't I? Should we do a little bit of alchemy? Just while uh, while we're kind of chilling and uh, waiting for people to turn up. Yeah. Ad time. <laughs> hey, Bert. I forget, of course, you live for another hour. Um, yeah, if you, if you want. I mean, I think the only people watching are subbed to me, I think. Unless your sub has expired. But, I mean, ask and you shall receive. Pretty princess. Is that what I am? 
Don't roll an ad, deliver me a personal ad for your stream. Okay, well, I'm running an ad at the moment anyway, but I mean, I do actually have... Um, check this out, hold on. Welcome to the stream. Look at this loser. Ah! Block you in. Yeah, boy! Oh, no! 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 Oh, no! Oh, I look fabulous. You look oh my god! It killed you. Oh my god, that was... Oh. There we go. Eggs and bacon. Excellent. Egg, excellent. Excellent. Yes! <laughs> He's made a tune out of me, like, slapping mayonnaise. And that is not a euphemism. That is amazing, isn't it? Instrument. It's... <laughs> mayonnaising. <laughs> I am... The evil pig. I will curse you. Viewers. I'm watching you. And there you go. I think we can all agree that I'm basically just uh, an idiot dork <laughs> that streams. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you very much for uh, for the request, Virtue. How are you doing, my friend? It's uh, it's going to be a good day. I mean, it's it's being a pretty good day already, to be fair. Sir. So, uh... I mean, you say that you've not been uh, online uh, much today, which uh, I tightly get. Uh, you've been up to much. I haven't reactivated my desktop audio. Hold on. Uh... Full screen game, so annoying. I, so I tried you know that um, website that you showed me, where you can like fix games so that they do, you know, more than what you want. How like how I fixed Abe's Odyssey so it wasn't all full screen. Yeah, that site literally said there's nothing you can do about this game being full screen. Nothing, nothing. Uh, so we kind of have to just live with the fact that, like. Every time I, I want to tab out, it's janky as fuck. Uh, Brit picked up a new car. Ooh, ooh, cool. What kind of car is it? I vaguely remember you mentioning a Duke, but I think that might be the old, the old one. Uh, Bethesda is yeah, basically. I've never played a Bethesda game before, as far as I'm aware. So this is my first experience of Bethesda game. I mean, the game itself is amazing, but the 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 oh, words matter. Stop talking in my ear, Mr. Himisca or whatever your name is. Um, yeah, but the bugs and just the jank is un unacceptable, frankly. I'm not in for it. Saya Arona. I've never even heard of it. I mean, I know Saya. I know the I know the company name, but an Arona. What kind of? I mean, it it sounds a little bit like Corona, if I'm honest with you, mate. I mean, I don't know. It's a nice car, to be honest. Nice. What kind of size is it? Is it like a small family car? Oh, general. We need to go. Uh, the more bugs, the better. I. I mean, you and I are. We agree on a lot of things. A lot of things. But that is one thing that I fully like hard disagree on you. Uh, 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 agree with on you. Why can't I get my words out today? I mean, I'm pretty bad normally, but no. It, a game. A game that you pay as much money as you would have had to have paid for this when it first came out should not have as many bugs as this does. Um, right, we need to go left and then it's it's very bad. An SUV? Okay, uh, I keep telling her that a car has a coronavirus. <laughs> That's amazing. Well, I hope it doesn't. I hope it works and like never goes wrong or anything because I know from experience that cars, when they go wrong, are just the biggest pain in, I was going to say in the nuts, but just in all of your major organs, <laughs> like your nuts, your, your backside, your spleen, you know what I mean. It's just annoying. I hate it. Right. Let's, uh, let's see what, what have we got here? We're going to, we're, we're going to just do a little bit. We're not going to do much of this. Wait, what, what just happened? Oh, we clicked the clear button. That's why. Uh, R is craft. And we're just, we're going to see a few, like, what we can make, just for a little while. 
Oh, bone meal. Bone meal's good. I like bone meal. Just purely because it's like it's quite easy to get hold of. In relatively large amounts. Death Bell. Ooh! Ravage Stamina. Wait, didn't we already know that one? Damn it. Mm. Oh, resist fire. Nice. That's resist fire as well, is it? Okay. Fortify conjuration. See, these are all nice, but they're not very useful for me. These are all things that would be like super nice if I was a spellcaster. Right. How much bone meal do we have left? Five. If there's anything I can help right. Uh, let's keep on the bone meal. Hanging moss. Right, let's stop on the bone mill for now, and we'll do some hanging moss. Uh, and fire salts. Hmm. No. Oh, garlic. I offer remedies for ailments, but um. How much is too much garlic? <laughs> uh, see, that's. I was, I was just thinking, who, who, whose stream was I watching? It was uh, Harry Hippo. Well, one of his mods, Thrister, who's awesome, I've met her, and um, she was like, how much garlic should I use? And <laughs> uh, Hippo was basically like, just use how much you want. Don't ask me. <laughs> it was amazing. Wait, what was that um, potion that we just uh, made? Let's do that again. Damage health. That's not that useful. I really want to learn how to make... Oh, we already know, don't we? I want to know how to make like healing potions and, and that kind of ilk. This isn't a very um, exact science so far. I mean, it should be, but I mean, in terms of me, like me doing this, it's not a very exact science. Because, I mean, we've learned quite a few recipes, but they're all crap. <laughs> they're all useless. Oh, damage health. We already know that one. <sighs> All right. I think that'll do for now. Oh, hold on. What's this? Poison of damage magic or regen. Again, not useful. I mean, I think that'll do for now. Uh, well, that's enough alchemy for today. Um, I will try and do a little bit more in-depth alchemy between streams if I can be bothered, just purely because, um, like I say, it's... Because of the fact that this game only works full screen, it's impossible to multitask um, when playing this game, which means it needs my full attention, um, and that's actually a lot more difficult than it sounds. I multitask pretty much the entire time I'm on the PC, unless I'm working. It's good to look up some stuff uh, for what you need, if you don't want to mix and match. I feel like, because of the way that alchemy works in-game, that like looking up recipes online is kind of cheaty. Um, I think I'd rather avoid that if I can, but we'll see. Oh, I thought that was you speaking for a second. I was like, no, that's not an old lady. Hello. I was the newest companion until you came along. I guess that's okay. Oh, we've spoken to you before. Because you're like, um, what's that character in Wind Waker that um, calls you Squabby? There's three items that make health potions. I think Zemzemra told me what they were. Like, I can't remember. I think one of them's Skeever, but I can't, I, I don't know. I could easily be wrong. But what I think I'm going to do is uh, we're going to put some stuff away. Um, the, I think we've already put food away, but we're going to put the ingredients away. You're close. Uh, see, I just I can't remember. I, I probably should be able to remember, um, but I've got a really bad memory. Right, let's put, I think we should put away pretty much all of this food, apart from maybe the bee, apart from maybe the, like, the already cooked food that we've picked up. You have two of the items. Okay. Uh, well, for now, I think I'm going to just leave it. Oh, look, at I think one of them was, no, Danger Hearts, I know that they're quite rare. We ended up picking up quite a lot of like herbs 
in that herb garden. Um, in I forget the name of it, but our um, our girlfriend's place, um, the um, the vampire's place. <laughs> I've decided it's uh, it's Mela Twenty One Cannon that um, we are um, we are dating her <laughs> just for shits and giggles, really. <laughs> It it pleases me a great deal. Like uh, maybe uh, maybe someone could uh, write some fanfic. <laughs> I'm joking. Please don't do that. Troll fat. Ugh. I don't think there's anything useful here. Right. Fanfic. Oh my god. Too late. What was it? What it's what, you made a fanfic? What of? Uh, my character in this, who is, I mean, you can't see underneath the, um, underneath the helmet, but, um, I am actually a, um, a Kajit, a Kajit male. So that's the cat race, if you don't, for anyone who doesn't know. Um, so I'm a Kajit male. She is a female vampire. She's definitely got the hots for me. You should have seen her last stream. She was all over me. <laughs> So all we need now is uh, Virtue's fanfic, and uh, I think we're, we're cooking on gas. <laughs> right. Now, uh, I have definitely... I can't believe we're only half an hour into the stream. I've definitely been drinking too much of this, because I do just want to be right back, just for a second. And But then we are immediately going to go and continue the story. So uh, don't go anywhere. <laughs> just to be clear, it's not me that loves her, it's my character. Anyway, I'll be right back just a few, few seconds. Don't, uh, I won't be long. Don't go anywhere. Hello. Wait, where's my button? That's a button. Are we all good? We're all good. Thank you so much for waiting. Really appreciate your patience. Lovely. Right, let's... Uh... There's the game. That's good. So, um... Hello. <laughs> um, we're going... No, hold on. Um, We want to go to the vampire's place up here kill the boneyard keepers castle there we go it's the balcony that's where we want to go now i have a theory that we're going to get munched here because it did seem quite difficult but um we should be able to i think we should be okay i think we should be okay we'll see but uh wish us luck munch 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 yeah munch some people don't think i'm smart fucking hate that guy <laughs> <laughs> okay, can I just jump straight in? Yay! Now, what I think I'm going to do, think, with a capital F, is um, I'm just going to step away slightly, and then what I would really like to do is, I think, if I leave... I'm going to leave a, like a... Can I leave them like a... Oh, I can't. 
I wanted to leave like a, a waypoint on the map, but I don't seem to be able to do that. Um, but that's okay. That's okay. Right. Uh, which of these things that we need to go to is the closest? Um, it doesn't seem to say. Let me just check. Beyond death. So we need to kill the boneyard keepers. We're all going down to the boneyard. All going down. No way to get out. So step inside and please enjoy the ride. Sorry, I'll stop singing. Right, we're just going to go uh, like straight line as close as we can to the near, like the nearest waypoint that we need to get to. Harvest. Wait, what? You have no empty soul gems to fill. Oh, okay. We sold all our soul gems, so never mind. Right. Wait, is this one of them? It's not, is it? Hmm. I love this place. I really do. It looks so cool. It's just a cool looking area. It's getting a bit warm in here as well. It is, yeah, it's just a really cool looking area. And so far I quite enjoy the, the um, lore for the area as well. What? I hope they add something like this in the next game. Hell yeah. I mean, I've literally never looked into a, um, a, 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 what's an Elder Scrolls game before. But I'm really, I'm genuinely enjoying this to the point where when the new game comes out, I might actually have some um, excitement for it. Uh, and I haven't had excitement for a new game for a very long time. I had some excitement for Breath of the Wild, but not as much as I should have, just purely because I knew I wasn't going to be able to play it. And for some reason, it's telling me to go out in that direction, but I can't. It's just at the edge of the map, dude. Unless, the, unless, I, unless I can, like, down this... This blue thing, it's going to be huge, which means more bugs. Theoretically, no. But, as we've discovered already, it's Bethesda, so probably yes. <laughs> I mean, it It should be that, you know, especially in, in this day and age, that, you know, it, the, what's it, the quality control should be better. But it clearly isn't. So, we'll see. Hello. Was a release, not an eternity of torment. I think it depends how you die, my friend. Uh, they have expanded their team by a huge amount within the last, last nine years. Well, hopefully that bodes well. <laughs> I am a hunter. I am a redeemer. I am Jewib. The tale of my rise to glory begins in the ashes... As wastes of Morrowind, I rode alone, weapon at my side, and the burning wind stinging my face. My quest was arduous, but necessary to ensure the survival of the Dunmere people. A pestilence was creeping across the Ashlands. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Is that you? I don't know. It just calls you soul, so... I mean, I genuinely don't know. Can we go in here? Oh! I'm not going to read them all. <laughs> I know that Arctic wants me to, but I'm not going to. We die, we pray, to live, we serve. The Master's voice, you swore to serve your Lord. Interesting. Okay. I was kind of hoping to be able to go through there. Uh, but apparently that's a window and not a door. <laughs> what is that emote? That's quite a cool emote, but what is it supposed to be? It's a bit on the small side, my friend. That's what she said. It isn't. <laughs> right. Uh, ah. Hold on. Who is this? Is this... Oh, it's you. You worried me. I thought you were a bad guy. Right. I think we're going the right way now. This looks good. Oh, someone's seen me, though. Yeah, Skyrim was made by 100 people. But clearly still not enough. Why do I keep getting seen and then hidden? Ah, uh, Mummy, I'm scared. Right, you're a good guy, right? Let's just... Oh, my Lord. Oh, that's that horse that we we're supposed to be looking for. 400. Wow, that's a lot. That's a lot more people, to be fair. 
sold something to a guy who turned out to work for a whole coven of necromancers. Oh, unlucky. How in the name of Xenithar was I to know the ingredients were phony? Do I look like someone that would double cross a necromancer? Well, uh, sure. Horse, wagon, plopped here without so much as a word. Cheers. I used to be one of the best traders in High Rock, you know. Now people would track me down just to see what I had for sale. Got anything left? Very funny. I wasn't trying to be funny. And what exactly are you going to pay me with? Take a look around. Gold doesn't exactly win you any friends around here. What's she doing? <laughs> uh, uh, Serena. Uh, uh, yeah, not now. <laughs> not now. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe later. I'll tell you what. I appreciate what you're trying to do, so I'll play along. The only thing I see around here in abundance are soul husks. Uh, you know, those ugly fungus looking things growing out of the ground. You need a soul gem to collect them, right? Say 25 of them, and you can rummage through what was left on my cart. Oh, that's nice of you. Odds and ends I've gathered over the years. Well, used to gather before all of this nonsense happened to me. <laughs> You're calling death nonsense. <laughs> Maybe we can make a deal if you have the husks. Do you know this guy's really nonchalant about the fact that he's dead? <laughs> no husks, no sale. Guess you have some scavenging to do. Excuse me. Keep her things and get back to the prison. Just wants to make some husks. Well, okay, I guess. But uh, I mean, that is only a side mission. Uh, I mean, we'll have a look about. Um, he did say that there'd be some on the wagon. What? No. Um, I mean, he did say there'd be some on the wagon, dude. I'm feeling slightly betrayed right now. There's nothing on there. What is that? That looks like someone's rear end. If you uh, if you do get the horse skull, you get to summon a skeletal horse. I want the horse now. Like, I wanted it before, but now I really want it. But I think we should probably... We should at least try and do the main mission. Like, part one of the main mission. That looks cool. Um, I guess we probably need to scale this. Uh, it's the best free horse. Hey, Smokey. How are you, my friend? It's cool to see you. It's the best free horse besides the one you get in the Assassin's Guild. I don't think we joined the Assassin's Guild, did we? I mean, we have joined quite a lot of uh, extracurricular activity. In this game. I don't think the Assassin's Guild is one of them. I'm not 100% sure. Is the Assassin's Guild the one that you join in... I forget the name of the town. But the one that's basically like Moss Eisley. Um, you know, where all all of the um, bad people go um, come from. How am I? Oh, I'm very well. Thank you very much for asking. Riften. Yes, Riften. I, is that the one? Riften Sorter. Ah, okay. Lovely. Um... I'm guessing this is not the right place. I'm not 100% sure. I'm just going to go around it one more time. No, this is not where we're supposed to go. Um, but yes, no, I'm absolutely fine. Thank you very much for asking. Um, the wife is going to go back to work in a couple of weeks. So my stream schedule is going to be crazy and mixed up. Uh, I'm going to change my main streaming day from Thursday to Friday. Uh, not, str um, not next week, but the week after. Um, but I'm going to try and stream for six hours every Friday instead of four hours. But it does mean also that the Saturday streams are probably going to stop. Well, they are definitely going to stop at least at first. I'm only going to be able to stream at the weekend uh, for a few hours at a time. Maybe if T is like having a nap. So we're going to have to see how that works. That does also potentially mean that T's probably like tea time is going to become a little bit rarer. Uh, because practically I'm going to be streaming when he's sleeping a little bit more uh you do have a mission there to get it in oh invited joining them was better in oblivion oh okay cool i genuinely don't know where i'm going by the way i'm kind of just faffing at the moment but i'm going to keep going 
Ah, there's the horse. What do I do to the horse? Do I need to shoot it? I mean, I'm down. <laughs> I'm down. <laughs> I mean, I've got plenty of boats now. In the Soul Realm thingy. Yeah, I think this place looks super rad. I really like the, uh, the, the, the sort of aesthetic of the area. It's very pretty. Oh, there's bad guys in this area. Oh, that was a nice shot. I think there's there's another one there. Ah, oh, I missed that time. Yeah, you stand you stand perfectly still. Oh, what a good idea. Just long enough for me to be able to shoot you right in your face. So what's uh, what's Smokey been up to, my friend? How you been? This looks like it might be one of my objectives. This looks quite good. I've been detected though by someone. There's a skull somewhere around the realm. What's the skull do? What is that? Is that a mob? Yeah, ah, this is one of the keepers I need to kill. Oh my god. Right. Yeah, you, you keep getting a... Uh, yeah, you keep on Serena. You just don't look... Don't even look at me. Ah, I got him in the knee. He used to be a keeper like me until he took a bolt to the knee. Oh, I didn't even mean to get him in the knee the second time. I've just been chilling, just waiting uh, for my job centre to respond to me. Oh, mate, uh, what kind of job are you looking for, if I may ask? Or are you in a situation where you're just like, anything that gets me money? Because, uh, I mean, that is quite understandable too, my dude. After you get it, um, there's a skull somewhere around. After you get it, you get the horse. Ah. Oh. Okay, kind of looking for a secretary job. Oh, interesting. Ah. That like, um, like, like typing kind of secretary or organising kind of secretary or like a PA kind of secretary. All very, um, worthwhile positions for sure. I always wondered how, um, kind of interesting that kind of job would be. Like, whether it'd be boring or whether it'd actually be, like, quite fun. Not, not fun fun, but you know what I mean, like, as, as far as, like, office jobs go. I always wondered. Ah. We have an enemy dead ahead, apparently. I don't see them, but... Uh, is that an enemy there? Is that what that is? My snicker snick has increased. I've been detected, so, I mean, it hasn't increased enough, clearly. Ha 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 ha. Bone man. All right. Right in the dick, or where that would kind of like chill stuff. Like maybe uh, order off supplies. Maybe uh, could you move out of the way? I want to loot a corpse. Oh, I can't. Uh, maybe help a bit uh, with it, and maybe making some coffee, like the intern. Fair enough, dude. Oh, is that the skull? I mean, it is a skull. I didn't mean to take the shield. That sounds like it might be quite uh, quite chill. Uh, if you can get something like that, that would be fantastic. Um, let me just have a quick look. Um, what am I doing? Items. I want to have a look at that skull. Um, skull. Uh, it's just a skull. I get the feeling that that is just a skull and it is not this skull that I was looking for. But we will find out. Right, now... Which of these two is closest, do you think? It's very hard to tell without the map actually telling us. And, I mean, at the moment the map is kind of being a bit useless, but I think it's because we haven't, like, cleared the map, as it were. Who said that? Oh, is it this guy? What do you want? How does anyone expect me to write my opus with all of these rude interruptions? High elf. Oh, oh, the high elves are the jerks, aren't they? What do I mean, indeed? If I hadn't lost... Well, he's obviously talking about his magnum opus, isn't he? ...in this predicament, and we wouldn't be having this conversation. Oh, don't worry, I'd be very happy if we weren't. Go on, then. S make... say your piece. I suppose a moment or two of my time couldn't hurt. I am Chip, 
Some call me Saint Jib. Others call me Jib the Eradicator. <laughs> Wait, this is the guy that was mentioned in one, in the note that we read, isn't it? Jib, I called him, or Jib. But he's just Jib. I can't say that I'm surprised by your answer. Until I get my second volume published, no one will ever know of my achievements. What's in the first volume, dude? A book. I'd hardly call a 26 volume epic simply a book. Surely you've heard of the. Check out R.R. R. Martin here. Hero of Morrowind and the <laughs> of the Dunmer. Maybe you should leave the writing to an expert. Stop making foolish suggestions. <laughs> in the midst of writing the second volume and they just threw me into this prison. It's unfair. It's so unfair. So what? What in the name of Vivek are you talking about? Vivek. Love it. All I remember is that damn Dramora and his minions bursting into my... I don't think he knows he's dead. Shall we break it to him, chat? Well, I assume so. It cast a spell at me from some kind of strange black crystal. Next thing I knew, I arrived here. Hmm. <laughs> My what? Wait. That means... <gasps> You're dead! No. All these wasted months? Has it been years? I don't even remember how much time has passed. Do you know what? No, my work will never see the light of day. I'm not even sorry. <laughs> Perhaps. Do you have a way out of me? Yeah, for me, not so much for you. Maybe I can't leave, but my writings can. In order to write the second volume of my book, <laughs> I need the notes from my first volume. Otherwise, I need to do all of this from memory. I love how Serena just fucks off with her knife out. When I was tossed in here, I felt myself falling, and I dropped the pages I had been holding. So they're going to be around the realm, I guess. Ten of them in all. Find them for me, please. I beg you. Well, that's a ridiculous question. Everyone traveling through here has said that the Oblivion Gates have been opening all over Tamriel. Interesting. I remember this quest. I'm really liking it so far. Um, well, I'm, I'm guessing you mean this particular quest. I mean the sort of DLC in, in, in general. Um, it's been a lot of fun so far, and it looks like it's really starting to heat up as well. Has it been that? My only... Uh, my only caveat is I get the feeling when I go back to the main quest I'm going to be vastly overleveled for it, but we'll see. Without a septum on the throne of the Empire, Dagon was able to keep Oblivion through the gates and attack. All I heard is that without a septum sitting on the throne of the Empire, the dragon fires in a place called the Temple of the One. We're no longer lit. Never felt overleveled in Skyrim, to be fair. To Good, I think. If you need to get quite up there, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. It's hard to say because I don't really know a huge amount about the game apart from what I've actually experienced. It's not that hard. Okay. Well, sneak is kind of our thing. Closed by now. He's in terms of law, he's kind of leaving me behind a little bit now. I think if I understood a little bit more about um, the law, I'd probably be able to get a little bit more out of what he's talking about. Uh, as it stands, I'm only getting some of it. Well, I mean hard. I meant more of the annoying, I guess. Yeah, I mean it's definitely annoying to be going around somewhere that you're not uh, leveled enough for and dying a lot. Speaking of which, um, I need to say <laughs> quick save. Um, that's definitely quite frustrating. Um, well, I mean, dying a lot in any game is frustrating, which is one of the reasons, by the way, that I wouldn't 
be able to put, like I wouldn't play a Dark Souls game or a Souls like game because I'd end up just getting really frustrated. Army of what? Hello, how are you doing? Welcome to chat. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> um, we have contact. I mean, all the time they're on Serena, I think we're okay. Oh, Serena, don't get in my way, though. I mean, you're very useful, but... What's it called? A mist man. <laughs> does that... Well, does that mean that... <laughs> I mean, if I shoot my arrow, does that mean I miss? Oh, that was so lame. That was a really bad... In fact, that was that was even... That was worse than a normal Melara dad joke. I apologise. Can we get an exclamation mark dad joke in chat, please? That would be, that would be nice, I think. Ah! Ah, 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 the horse skull. Aha. Thank you. Uh, every night. Hold on. Every night at 11.11, I make a wish that someone will come and fix my broken clock. <laughs> so bad. Thank you very much, Smokey. Um, what difficulty? I don't remember getting an option. So knowing me, it will probably be standard like normal difficulty. I'm not 100% sure, though. Uh, I can't remember, if I'm honest. Now, I think we're getting close. We're getting close to the objective. Ah, except there's some other perps hanging about. Whoa! I'm getting another... Oh, hold on uh, there, uh, Arctic. Oh my god, hold on. Uh, what was the pumpkin's favourite sport? Squash. Thank you very much, Arctic. I hope you enjoyed. Oh, we should have bought some healing potions before we came out. Never mind. Can we move a bit faster, please? Wait, where are the perps? Oh my god! Right, where's the other one? There was one more, wasn't there? Oh, there you are. Where's... Uh, I need my shout as well. Oh. You're already dead. I don't need the shout then, do I? Is there more? Where are you going? Serena! Where are you going? Alright, there's obviously someone up here that's shooting at me that she's going for. What are you doing? Ah, oh, you're funny. Yay, Silver! How you doing, mate? Nice to see you. No, you. Hello. Ah, oh, you just got... You just got executed, son. Oh. <laughs> he doesn't get... He, he didn't just get executed. You, you got... <laughs> you just got ruined, mate. You got... Oh, what's the word? Humiliated. See you Ah, <laughs> uh, that was... Uh, that that was quite pleasing. I, I'm uh, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, that made me quite happy. Uh, was that that wasn't one of the dudes that I need to kill though? So I mean, as fun as that, as fun as that was, that wasn't one of the dudes that I'm looking for. That was you're, this wasn't the droid I was looking for. He got lame laminated. <laughs> yeah, we uh, we just put a thin layer of plastic over him. <laughs> How are you doing, Silver? It's cool to see you. How are you? How's things? We, are you having a... What the bloody hell just happened? Did I just die? Was that a de That wasn't a death. That was a teleport, right? Right? What? That was a teleport. Is this a teleporter? Let me just try that one more time. Right. Okay. That's definitely a teleporter. It didn't kill me. That's weird. Alright. I mean, I don't really see the point of being able to do that. Now, I just want to double check one more thing. I'm not going to go in it again, but I want to see... Right. I want to just remember what it looks like, because it looks quite similar to those, like, random lights that are about. But yeah, Silver, you said you are having a bad day, um... Was it yesterday? You're having a better day today? 
Right, we are visible to someone. Meh. Well, as long as it's better than yesterday, right? Your boss is still being a jerk, or...? Right, we must be close now. Oh, there's the guy. That's him there, right? Isn't it? No. Heat exhaustion today. What? Why? Are you, uh... Are you stuck in the outdoors today? God, it's so dark. Wait, is he in this can? Um... Ah, oh, we need to... I was working outside. Shit, man. Well, it did tell me to go this way. Where the fuck are we now? Oh, my lord. This is quite cool, actually. Are you staying hydrated, though, yeah? It's very important to stay hydrated, my dude, when you're st working outside in the heat. I mean, I'm sure you know this. Um, Have some water, dude. Or even better, have some Red Bull. <laughs> I know this isn't Red Bull, by the way, guys. It's it's discount Red Bull, but we're all good. I will say yes. Good. I'm glad to hear it. Wait, are these... Bad guys? No. Nope. But not as much as I should. Okay. Well, as long as it's something, it's better than nothing. Um, should we speak to this person? I can't, by some for some reason. I bet that's a bug. Maybe not, actually. It is making a sound. Anyway. Hello. Oh, hello, mate. Ow. Hold on. Can I get behind Serena? I'm going to hide behind... <laughs> hide behind my girlfriend. <laughs> she can go into harm's way. Oh, yes. That works for me. What happens if Serena dies? She's definitely hurt. I mean, not very much, but she's definitely hurt. Ah, oh, execution. Have it. Fallen off the side again. <laughs> See you later. Right, lovely. Right, this, oh, this teleports me back down to the bottom then, I guess. Ah, that makes sense. Some NPCs are essential. I get the feeling that Serena... Might be essential for this quest line, but maybe afterwards she might be killable. I mean, I don't want her to die. I mean, we've already discovered she's basically Bay. <laughs> I'm, I'm not going to let this die. It's, <laughs> it's, it's going to be a meme. It's only on or off. Oh, okay. Well, in that case, I'm guessing she probably can't die. Because as far as I know, like, for this DLC, she's essential. So, in if that's the case and they can't let her die, then she's probably not going to die at all. Unless their death is scripted. Okay. I, I, I don't imagine that happening either, if I'm honest. Because um, if she's a, a follower... I mean, it's it's difficult to say because I don't really know the MO of Bethesda. But it just seems like it would be really mean to kill off um, someone like that. Um, we'll definitely take all of that. What? Oh, hello. Didn't even see you there, buddy. I don't think I really needed the shout, to be fair, but... Oh, it's a pretty soul gem. Would you like my pretty soul gem? <laughs> How do we... Ah, is that another teleporter? Is there a way up? Or is it just the torch? Because the problem is, the teleporters and the torches look very similar. Am I being damaged? Why is it showing my health? It's 100% petty, not pretty. Oh. Well, I won't give her a petty gem then. <laughs> or maybe I will. Maybe maybe it's a love-hate relationship that we have with Serena. <laughs> oh, it's this one again. We've been here. We, we, we came here earlier. Hmm. Where should we take... Um, once we've done this quest, we should go and hand in the... Um, I want the horse. We should go hand in the horse's uh, the horse's skull. So then we should definitely. Oh, we should. I think we should do that before the main quest. Actually. Wait. What's this? Why is it glowing? Why is this area? Why is this area glowing? Hmm. 
I like. I do like the atmosphere. Actually, it's a really cool atmosphere. Like menacing. And just just a tiny bit on the creepy side, but not overpoweringly so. Hmm. It's quite a long walk. How's everyone doing today, huh? It's Thursday. I can only believe it's Thursday already. I don't know if it's just me, but this week has gone so quickly. Same as last week, actually. Last week went super fast as well. It's gone in a flash. I'm going back to uh, into the office, uh, not next week, but the week after as well. I'm actually going back into the office uh, the same week that my wife is going back to work from maternity. Okay, I think we're getting close now. I'm guessing it's going to be at the top of this structure, but I'm not sure. Hmm. Is there a way up this structure, do you think? This has got to be it, right? Whoa! Whoa, fuck. Oh, hello. Whoosh! Oh my lord, these guys, oh, oh, oh god, it's the big guy, no, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, it's been like ages since I've, no, 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 oh, uh, hmm, <clears throat> lame, I don't know when the last time I quick saved it was, oh, that's annoying, alright, Kerrigal, calm down, I know we died, you called. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty lame that we died. Kind of, uh, kind of annoyed about that. I um, I feel a little bit ambushed. Even though, if you, if I was to watch it back, I'd probably only have myself to blame. <laughs> right, hold on. I should, I should also say, uh, quick save it more often. Yeah, because we've, we've been here. <laughs> you should do, um, what's it, Lurch, where he's like, you ran, um, wait, which, <laughs> what's that from, that's from, um, Lurch is, because I always get, I always get, well, quite often get, um, the Adams Family and the Monsters mixed up, be right back, no eyes, in fact, you know what, I'm just going to be right back as well, uh, I'm only going to be two minutes, please don't go anywhere, I'll be right back. Thank you so much for waiting. I really appreciate your guys' patience. I hope you're enjoying the show. We are currently looking for the third and final of these bone people. <laughs> In order to... Um, I can't even remember exactly why we want them. Uh, if I'm honest, it was a whole month ago. What happened? Hey, Matt. Cheers for the... Why did that not come up on chat? Thank you for the full little bit. Oh, there it is. 
dropped a thing, Mela, you clumsy goofball. <laughs> ah, that's funny. Clumsy Mela, I know. I'm such a klutz. Thank you so much for the little biddies. That's really, that's really cute of you, dude. How you doing, Matt? How's things? How's your day going? Right, I think we're close now. Clumsy Mela, I know. Cheers for the lurk there, Silver. You legend. You are a legend. The most legendary of all legends. <laughs> Ah, oh, that is some good shit. But yeah, how you doing, Matt? It's cool to see you. Hmm. I'm really lamenting the fact that I'm missing um, Moon's um, crowd control um, stream right now as well. That'd be so much fun to watch. Uh, just helping uh, people put... Uh, hang on. Just helping people out, I'm guessing, when they keep dropping things. <laughs> oh, that's cute. I killed her lots. I bet you did. <laughs> that must be so annoying, but that's funny. Uh, happy birthday, Moon. <laughs> uh, I think I might have to watch the VOD of that. I think that'll be fun, but I wish I was there. But I've got to keep to my schedule, man. And this, this is cool. This is cool. I love, I love the fact that you guys are here. I really do. Right, we, we're coming close now. To where we got ambushed and killed last time. Right, Serena, get on your toes. Right, I'm pretty sure this is it. So let's try and be just a little bit more careful than last time. We'll get our weapon out. <gasps> Clots. <laughs> that scared me, man. <laughs> Cheers, bro. Right, here we go. Right, we're going to go... Oh man. Alright, because there's actually quite a few of these. Alright, all the time, but worth it. All the time that Serena's tanking them, we're kind of okay. Right. Done and done, yeah, but what about the actual dude that we came here for? There we go, that's the guy. Right, backing away. Serena, what are you doing? There's just a bad guy like, right there, like, attacking you. <laughs> Don't focus me. I mean, I know you like looking at my sexy face, but you can't even see because I'm wearing a helmet. Kappa. Uh, of Mela as a heart attack because I cheered one bit. Ban me. <laughs> uh, heart attack because I cheered one bit. Ban me from Moon's chat. <laughs> Bless. Kappa. <laughs> <laughs> right, it's time to loot some corpses, eh? Interrupts the soul drain effect in the soul can. Is this 10% of magic? Hmm, interesting. Right, let's quick save. What the? I didn't mean to pick up the swords. How I, I, how encumbered are we right now? Ah, uh, we're okay. If we come, if we become a little bit more encumbered, then uh, I'll uh, I'll throw down the uh, the sword. I actually didn't mean to pick it up. I'm kind of hoping that we'll be able to open this and take a shortcut back. I'll ban you, all right, Kappa. Okay, Arctic, wait, uh, wait till I do the manslaughter on that. <laughs> oh my days! <laughs> I do the same, if I'm honest. Um, when uh. When the old toot is playing a bone man. Where? Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from? Cup Nigel. Yeah, when he's playing scary uh, scary games, he's got like a, a redemption that's like, stomach in, shoulders back. Oh, thank you for the biddy. And uh, yeah, I use that to scare the shit out of him sometimes. It's really funny. I'll speed up the process. Um, this door obviously has to be openable, but I can't figure out how to open it. I mean, by all means, kill them while they while they can't get us, uh, Serena. I mean, you're doing the Lord's work, love. But how do I open the door? <laughs> um, I mean, the music is epic, but it also feels a tad. Uh, it's just unnecessary at the moment because we can't reach the bad guys that the music's for. <laughs> 
I like my bit badge. They're all um, they're all um, rupees, and they go up um, in the in the order that they would do in Zelda. So it's it's, it's like green, blue, uh, green, blue, green, blue, yellow, red, or is it green, yellow, blue, red? I'm struggling to remember now because you don't get yellow rupees in Ocarina. You only get them in games like Wind Waker, which I haven't played for ages. And then um, the last one I think is orange for mine. I think it goes higher than that in the actual game, though, because I think you can get silver rupees and gold rupees. I don't know where I'm going, by the way. Um, I think I'm probably not sure. Oh, you probably can't open it then. Um, I don't favour this map. This map is not as useful as it really should be, in my opinion, at least. But uh, it's time to earn an orange rupee. <laughs> Um, I don't think anyone's got one. Um, you've got, I, th I think um, the highest anyone's gotten is uh, what you've got there, uh, Smokey, which is the blue rupee. But seriously, I, I really appreciate the heck out of uh, all of you guys. How much is it? Um, I don't know without literally double checking, uh, if I'm honest. Um, it's quite a lot. It's more than I would ever um, think anyone would ever actually get. I think I can check. Oh, that'd be cool, because I can't remember, and I can't tab out, unfortunately. Oh, 100 Bone Man. I wonder if we'd be able to do that. Oh, hello. <laughs> I didn't even know you were there. Oh, <laughs> ruined! <laughs> Did you see him, like, just get yeeted? Be right back. No worries, uh, Matt. Nice one. I remember, I remember looking at the bit badge, uh, the like the amounts when I actually put the badges in, and just remembering th thinking that the like the actual amount of money someone would have to spend on that is ridiculous because it goes up to like it it goes up to somewhere in the region of like a hundred thousand dollars. It's just insane. Um, wait, I wanted. That's what I wanted. I can only see the next big patch is at, um, I know that that's at £10, basically, or $10. That, that, yeah, it is, it's ridiculous. But um, my bit badges definitely go up, don't go up that high because I was like, it's completely unnecessary. It's never going to happen. I mean, I'd genuinely be concerned if it did. I'd be like, seriously, you need to not do that. <laughs> but, I mean, I don't know. It's just ridiculous, really. I can't imagine anyone doing that for anyone at all. Like, even, like, the massive big streamers, you know? Speaking of biddies... Oh, Matt. Welcome back, my dude. Yeah. Even, like, the massive streamers, I can't imagine, like, even over the space of, like, I don't know, a year or even ten years, a hundred thousand dollars. A hundred thousand dollars. Can you even imagine? It's ridiculous. What the... F oh, my lord. Shit, shit, shit. Run, 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 run. I, I, uh, I forgot that I still had that there. I put that there for Halloween and thought, I thought I'd removed that. I <laughs> scared that scared me. To be fair, I I put it there because I I don't I wouldn't normally do a Halloween stream, but Halloween happened to be a Thursday last year, which is the day that I stream anyway. So I played a, a really good game called um, Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion. It was loads of fun, and I nearly died from heart attack partially because the game is actually super spooky and has lots of jump scares in it but if Hondi kept using that uh, redemption as well and they're like the the stream was only about two hours long two i think it was about three hours long because it was not long after uh, t had been born uh it was back when i was kind of like sliding back into getting used to it um uh, getting used to streaming again, so my st streams were a little bit shorter back then. Uh, but I literally think I would have stopped when I stopped, in, like when I ran out of time anyway, because I was like, my heart was just going. I felt like I, I, I felt like I needed to sit down, even though I was sitting down. <laughs> Honestly, it was really funny. It was a brilliant stream, and yeah, I felt like I, I felt like I was going to die of a heart attack or something. But yeah, thanks for that. Uh, thanks for the uh, uh, for the bits as well, um, Smokey. I genuinely forgotten that I hadn't turned that off, because. Um, it's supposed to be, um, there's a Rickroll run, one that plays like the first, uh, 
So, nine. There's a Rick Roll run that plays like the first um, 30 seconds of um, the Rick Astley song. And there's another one that's like, guess who's back? That costs bits and the rest are all free. And most of them are um, memes as well. Okay. Uh, the number, man, your BPM. Uh, I, I, I kind of, I wouldn't mind... A <laughs> Are you back? Where are you back from? Thank you very much for the little cheer there, Spikey. Fool, you fools! That's from a, a gig I wish I was at. Uh, misfits. I never get. Um, I need to get over Kamani. <laughs> what do you mean? What happened with Kamani? Dare I even ask? I I had something I was going to say, and it's completely left me. But I just need to open the window. Two seconds, guys. It's getting really warm in here. I'm just gonna get. Uh, I'm just trying to one up him. <laughs> oh bless! Yes, we managed to destroy them all. Are you able to give us a stroll now? Please follow me. Follow me. Keep watch for Dernavir. With the prison's barrier down, he's almost certain to investigate. Okay. All right then. Oh, this place looks cool. Look at the size of this door. <laughs> We're going into the boneyard chat. The the boneyard. <laughs> right. Oh, there's going to be like a boss or something in here. I can feel it. Fun times coming up. Yeah, man. Oh, well, I was sort of right. Where did you come from? The sky, Serena. Are you blind? Oh, it creates ads. Cheers one bit because I ran out. Aww. Don't worry about it, man. I do really appreciate you. What's important is that you're here. Oh. I missed. I love the fact that the game port. Oh, my lord. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, you're named and everything. Oh, I, I love dragons, man. Dragons are so fucking cool. Is it one? Or did it just move really quickly just then? No, no, it's the same one. Why am I moving so slowly? <laughs> oh, my days. Hold on. There you go. While we're fighting a boss, you can have the event scene. Oh, uh, that was that was a really shitty miss. Come on, Mella. Right, hold on. Is your heart rate back to normal? I I don't know. It might be slightly elevated because I'm fighting a boss. It's hard to say. I actually wouldn't mind a heart rate monitor. I'm um. That's one thing because I mentioned earlier, right? Um, the wife's going back to work very soon, which means that my stream schedule is going to change. And that was the trigger, if anyone who's been here before, uh, I've said that I, there's like some um, stream upgrades that I'd quite like. I did say that I would get some stream upgrades um, after the wife goes back to work and I sort of figure things out. So I may very well get uh, buy some little uh, treats, sort of stream treats quite soon. Um, I'd quite like a new microphone is the main one, but I'd also really like a, um, a stream deck. But I could quite easily throw something like a heart rate monitor in there as well. Um, just for a bit of fun. Is that is that a bad guy? Oh no, it's um, Serena's um, like pet thing. So yeah, we'll uh, we'll see how that goes. It kind of depends how much the microphone ends up costing, because uh, that depends on sort of how much money we have left. Don't you kind of have a stream deck? Yes, yes. Actually, let me just because uh, um, that is worth noting. So it's not really a stream deck. It's actually a Kindle Fire that has. Um, an app on it which allows me to, to change and only change my scenes uh, while I'm playing uh, which is great but it also means because it's only for Streamlabs and I don't really want Streamlabs anymore I want to move back to uh, OBS Studios and excuse me and use Stream Elements and all the time that I'm stuck with 
because I, I basically I I'm not willing to completely forego the stream deck uh, the thing like sort of the discount stream deck because apart from anything else, I wouldn't be able to do basically anything on the stream right now in this game because this game only works full screen because, it, you know, Bethesda. Um, so it's kind of not an option for me. Um, so what I'd like to do is if I get a stream deck, I will then switch back to um, OBS Studio and get stream elements instead. I mean, I do have stream elements, but I mean, I'll switch everything over to stream elements and leave Streamlabs in the dust, preferably. Good points. Yeah, man. That's the idea anyway. Because um, there's a lot more that you can do with a proper stream deck as well, um, more than I can do with this. Because you can make, um, you you don't just, you, you can not only change scene, but you can like, you can automate loads of shit. That was also quite an easy boss. I really, I did quite enjoy that though. Why can't I search the dragon? Where did the dragon go? Oh. I'm kind of sad. Any particular reason why Streamlabs isn't working for you? I, I don't like their business model. Um, I don't know what they've done because they used to have all these cool features. And they still have the features, but they've made it so you have to pay for them. Um, but also, um, there's things that you can do in Studio that you can't do in Streamlabs. Yeah, it's just kind of a bit shitty. So I'm quite I'm quite keen to get rid of them, to be honest. Moon's using it right now. If you haven't seen a merch shop, it's amazing. Use it. What she's using? What? Sorry, Stream Labs. But I never thought I'd witness the death. Yeah, the trouble problem with their street, their, their merch store. Their merch store is good, but their markup is ridiculous. Like they're very money grabby, in my opinion. It appears they were mistaken. Unless the soul of a dragon is as resilient as its owner's scaly hide. It's possible that your killing blow has merely displaced Donavir's physical form. While he reconstitutes himself. Yeah, Streamlabs is definitely good for ease of use for beginners. I, I, I feel like um, it's time for um, basically a stream upgrade. I make I make little improvements pretty much bet between pretty much every stream, but I, I want to sort of like take things to the next level. And I feel like one of the things that would do that would be to move over to Elements because everyone I know who's moved over to Elements, they're like they're. The quality of like the way that their stream kind of flows in terms of like how bots and stuff works is just better. I can't even begin to guess. I suggest we don't wait around to find out. Now let's get you the Elder Scroll, and you can be on your way. Okay. Uh, I tried switching to OBS, but I feel it's too much effort. It is a lot of effort, to be fair. Oh, wait. What's all this? Oh, look at all this loot. Do you actually have merch? I don't. I would actually, I, I wouldn't mind. Um, I've always wanted a hat uh, with a Mel RM on it, like a black cap um, with a Mel RM on it. I wouldn't also mind maybe a beanie hat as well. I actually wear hats quite a lot when I go out. Um, like just for myself, really, more than anything else. Um, I also wouldn't mind a mug. Um, I do somewhere I have a bit rated mug because I used to do a podcast with Mr. Zendo and we had like a an official um, uh, uh, an official logo and we actually had a cup uh, a mug with uh, with the official bit rated logo on it. It was super cool. I'm just going to do a, a hard save um, that I always used to uh, use on stream while we were podcasting. It was good. Oh, here we go. Here's an Elder Scroll. There we go. Um, I'd buy a beanie. Yeah, I, I'd, I'd quite like um, to have that available. It's just something that has always kind of been in the back of my mind, but I've never really looked into. Uh, I think I'd looked into it once, but it was quite a while ago before Streamlabs did hats. I think they did one type of hat and it was like, it was not the type of hat that I wanted. Because a cap is more important to me than a beanie. Uh, back when I was looking for a cap, I was looking for a streamer YouTube merch to buy. Uh, well, um, I might sort something out at some point in the not too distant future, especially if I'm making like, hello, what are you doing? If I'm making like stream, uh, stream upgrades anyway. You've retrieved the Elder Scroll. You should be on your way. Are you coming with me? Before you depart, you must let me know. Yeah, can I help you get your soul back, lady? Some of the lessons I taught her about necromancy, did she? Hmm. 
I think I can help you. What do you mean you think you can help me? I've just offered to help you. Your soul essence was trapped inside a gem. Oh, okay. When you and Serana entered the soul cairn, it was given to the ideal masters as payment. Okay. You simply need to retrieve the gem. The moment you touch it, your soul essence will be restored. Okay. There's an offering altar not terribly far from here. I'm willing to bet that the gem you're looking for is there. Okay. Is there anything else? Could be your last chance. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, oh, are you staying here? I have no choice. As I told you before, I'm a daughter of Cold Harbor. If I return to Tamriel, that increases Harkon's likelihood of bringing the tyranny of the sun to fruition. Hmm. As much as it pains me to send you and Serana back alone, I can't take the risk. You're going to do embroidered? I don't actually know what the options are, if I'm honest with you, Smokey, but... I mean, when I imagine it, I imagine an embroidered M. But I think that's quite expensive, isn't it? You'll keep my daughter safe. She's the only thing of value I have left. Why does everybody talk about Serana like she's an item rather than a person? Like her dad does that as well. It's uh it's kind of rude, lady. Did you have anything to ask before you depart? Even if I could, it would only serve to hinder your efforts. You'll see why later on. Okay, well, we had this conversation before, didn't we? When we were like, we need the light. And it turns out that the light is is actually the girl. So maybe it's that. Well, they aren't exactly nice people. I mean, I don't know. Saran is pretty nice to me. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right, we've already had this. But I wanted to... Oh, uh, yeah, her parents are kind of dicks, yeah. Were not only to fail, but to be destroyed. Okay, there, there's a reason about uh, smart stuff. Well, thank you. Um, thank you for not spoiling it. I do appreciate that very much. He's no longer the man I married all that time ago. He's obsessed, insane. Everyone around him fears him as they would a rabid dog. For all of this to end, he must die. You sent it to me in a DM. Oh, oh yeah, cool. You mean the spoiler? Yeah, cool. Remember that Harkon's not to be trusted. Yeah, but you said that I wasn't to be trusted only uh, like an hour and a half uh, ago of game time, roughly. Um, right, we want. I want to take like everything that's here. I mean, I'm not sure about the rolls of paper, but everything else. Well, we don't need the books. All right, thank you very much. Uh, well, okay. party, my dear. Welcome to the party, my dear. Thanks ever so much for the host, uh, Smokey. I really do appreciate it. That's cool of you, dude. Does so anybody know the film that that uh, little quote's from? I completely forgot to host. It's all good, man. I appreciate it. I do. Um, oh yeah, we've got to go through the the big door now. I'm guessing I want to I want to do the horse head thing next. Um, and then. I don't really watch many movies. Ah, hey, wait. What is that? Are you going to attack me? Stay your weapons. I would speak with you, Quanarin. Quanarin. I like your voice. Are oh, you the boss that we just fought? Cursed, not dead. Doomed to exist in this form for eternity. Trapped. Between Lars and Enoch. Between life and death. It's um it's a James Bond movie. Why are we speaking? Didn't you try to kill me? I have more pressure. Why didn't you why did you try to kill me? Hostility was necessary. I was bound to an oath. Are you not still bound to that oath then? I believe in civility among seasoned warriors. And I Dodge this. Of my words. My <laughs> hands have rendered the flesh of innumerable foes, but I have never once been felled on the field of battle. What I think we'll do, uh, Smokey, thanks for that redemption, by the way, is we'll watch it during tea time. 
Which is probably going to be in about half an hour or so. In your awesome. Uh, I found you equally... To be honest with you, if I'm genuinely like 100% honest, you were a pretty easy boss battle, so calling you worthy is being very giving. Do me great honor. <laughs> desire to speak with you was born from the result of our battle, Quanarin. I love it. I really like his voice. I merely wish to respectfully ask a favor of you. More over level than I was. If I'm honest, uh, Smokey, I've been, like, purposefully doing quite a few of the side missions that we've been given. You are lower level and easy, easier difficulty. True. For countless years I've roamed the soul cairn in unintended service to the ideal master. Unintended. Before this, I roamed the skies above Tamriel. I desire to return there. Okay. Uh, I guess I retract my statement about being overleveled. <laughs> no, fair enough. It's okay. Uh, be level one with one HP. Yeah, no. I mean, we actually took relatively small amount of damage during the fight. In fact, I think I only took a few HP from the actual boss. Um, the damage, most of the damage that we took in the fight was from the ants. I fear that my time here has taken its toll upon me. I share a bond. James Bond. In this dreaded place. If I ventured far from the Soul Cairn. My strength would begin to wane until I was no more. No more. I will place my name with you and grant you the right to call my name from Tamriel. That's a dragon shout, isn't it? Do me this simple honor and I will fight at your side as your Graze Mazen, your ally, and teach you my Thum. Thum. <laughs> <laughs> Why that pleased me? Just call your name in Tamriel. That's it. Tamriel in your mind, perhaps. For me, it would mean a great deal. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll do it. I don't require an answer, Quinarin. Simply speak my name to the heavens when you feel the time is right. Getting a dungeon ally this early is nice, but you need the three dragon souls. You mean the Faz Rodar thing? Is that what you mean? Learn the first word of... Oh, t the soul tear. So we need the all three words. Is that what you're saying? A summoned... Okay. How did you end up in the soul cane? Why call me... Okay, all the things just happened. Dying shout, dung. So did we just learn more than one shout? There was a time when I called Tamriel my home. But those days have long since passed. Yeah, I taught you all three. Nice. The Dova roamed the skies, vying for their small slices of territory. What's Dova? Is that the dragons? Immense and ultimately fatal battles. I was, but unlike some of my brethren, I sought solutions outside the norm. In order to maintain my superiority, mm -hmm. I began to explore what the Dova call Elok Dilan, the ancient forbidden art that you call necromancy. That's how you ended up down here. The ideal masters assured me that my powers would be unmatched. That I could raise legions of the undead. In return, I was to serve them as a keeper until the death of the one who calls herself Valerica. I recognize that name. I discovered too late that the ideal masters favor deception over honor and had no intention of releasing me from my. <laughs> They had control of my mind, but fortunately they couldn't possess my soul. Okay. Free? No. I have been here too long, Quanari. How long has he been here? 
The soul cairn has become a part of what I am. I can never fully call Tamriel my home again, or I would surely perish. I only hope that you will allow me the precious moments of time there through your call. Okay, so we know what the call does as well. It literally says it summons him, so. In my language, the Quanaran is the vanquisher, the one who has bested a fellow Dover in battle. Okay. You are the Dover Keen, the Dragonborn. You may not be one of us in body, but you have earned the right to bear this title. Bear. I'm not a bear, I'm a dragon. <laughs> uh, okay. Thank you, uh, good sir, uh, for all that sort of, I wouldn't say exposition, but for all the information, mainly about you. But um, yeah, it was cool. Um, you're very cool. I appreciate you. Uh, let's go. Um, I want to check. Let's have a look at the quest that we've got here. Um, what's so beyond death is the one that we were. So it basically wants us to return to Tamriel. But what's the one that we've got for? Um, I want the horse one. Uh, do, 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 do. Which one is the horse one? Hmm. I also want to do Break of Dawn at some point quite soon. Um, which one's the horse one? <laughs> Is it in miscellaneous? Is that why I can't find it? Ah, uh, uh... Return Arvax, got this is the one. I'm gonna turn that one off. Look, cheers, sir, um, Smokey. Um, I'll try and, like, call you out, um, be like, Smokey, um, when I'm about to watch that video. Um, Boneyard. Right, hold on. Where are we going? Oh, God. Right, I'm hoping that this is taking me in the right place. If it's taking me um, for the main quest, I'll be a little bit frustrated. But we'll see where it takes us. Right, awesome. Well, that was quite interesting, I feel. It definitely helps immerse uh, you sort of in the world. I mean, you could also just watch it next time I'm here. Um... I don't know, man. <laughs> so I find you watching it during tea time. All right, well, I'll, I'll try and call you out anyway to see if you're about. Uh, it shouldn't be long, actually. It should be in like less than half an hour now, uh, depending on when the wife brings him in. But uh, we'll see. It's also like we'll keep him on for like minimum 20 minutes. It's just a cute little video. Awesome. Well, I can't watch. Oh, I can't wait to watch it. That'll be fun. But yeah, normally. Um, I normally watch the videos either during tea time or if it's after tea time then just at the end of the stream like just before um like after the game is finished but before we actually end stream that's what i've been doing recently i mean if this game wasn't so annoying with full screen i could probably just stop uh the game and, and watch the video for a bit but because it's so janky if i was playing pretty much any other game it would probably be a bit easier I'm assuming I'm going in the right direction for this, by the way. I, I hope I am. It's kind of hard to tell. You're a cute little video. <laughs> You're breathtaking. Yeah, no, it's taking us to the exit. It's annoying. I don't want to go to the exit. Hold on. Uh, let's go back here. So if I take Beyond Death off, will it now... <sighs> there we go. Ah, hold on. That should work now, right? That's right. It's over in this direction. Okay, I'm quite happy that we're going in the right direction now. I'm guessing it's just along here. Hopefully it's not far. 
And I'm guessing that once we've got the horse, we could probably, I'm hoping we can summon it outside of this um, realm as well. Like when we're actually in Tamriel. That would be so cool. Like an, I like a nice death horse. I always loved the undead horses in World of Warcraft. I think they look really cool. Especially um, the Midnight Horse from Karazhan. And the Headless Horseman horse. And also, um, I love the um, the Warlock level 60. I don't think it's 60 anymore. The the epic mount from the Warlock. It used to be a quest, but you just get it now. It used to be a really long quest that involved uh, going into loads of dungeons and spending loads of gold. That I remember doing back in vanilla days. Uh, it took me like over a month. And um, it involved lots of people's help. I think it helped a lot that I was one of the leaders of the guild because people sort of came into the dungeons and helped me because you had to do these like really long events, like special events. It was good fun though, it was good fun. But it was really long and complicated. <laughs> Especially the last part, the last part of the quest you had to go into Diamond West and like literally kill every single mob in the entire dungeon before you could even start the event. And then the event was like this really long, like 10 minute, like arena thing. Oh my God, it was crazy. And if you failed the arena, you had to do the whole arena again as well. It was fun though, if you had the right group for it. This is quite a long trek. This is a lot longer than I was expecting it to be. I feel like we must be getting close now. So, quick save it, because that was quite a long walk. Oh, come on, we must be nearly there. This place is actually pretty big. Aha! We're getting close now. Is this it here? Oh, I remember. We, we've been here. Aha! Is this it here? No, nope. we've still got a little bit further to go. This is it. Hello, mate. You right there, my lover? Arvac! You saved him! His soul is free, I can feel it! He's such a loyal beast. Here, I'll teach you how to call him to you. Awesome, thank you. He'll help you get around this wretched place. But I'm sure he'd be much happier someplace sunny. Sonia, so we can bring him to Samuel. Take good care of Arvac for me. Such a good horse. So you've got a pony song, basically. Thank you. I can't move. Ah. Right. So. We can summon him now? Is it a magic? No. Is it a shout? No. Conjuration. Summon Arvac. You don't have a map. What? What? So, I can summon Arvac, but I can't summon Arvac. Blast! Oh, hold on. I need more Magicka. Maybe I can summon him from Tamriel, actually, because I do have less Magicka than I would do. Alright. Alright. <laughs> I'm, I'm a bit salty about that. I better, be, I better be able to summon him from Tamriel, man. I better. Right, I'm just going to be right back really quickly. I won't be long. Please don't go anywhere.
Yay, thank you so much for waiting, guys. I really do appreciate your patience. Uh, you're weakened here. Ah, well, that makes sense. It's kind of annoying now because it does mean I'm going to have to walk all the way back. What? But uh, let's go back to uh, Beyond Death. And uh, we'll walk back and we'll come out of this area. I don't know if we ever come back here. The game seems to think that we're never coming back here. By the way, that like we spoke to... Um, I forget her name, but um, Serana's mum. But you never know. You never know. Right. Uh, oh, we'll definitely harvest these. I don't know if this is cheeky, but I'm going to go get wood from another one. <laughs> uh, good times. That, that was ages ago. That wasn't just Terraria, which was quite some time ago. It was like the beginning of Terraria as well. Kind of the beginning anyway. That was that was a lot of fun. We had loads of fun in Terraria. Had like a, a proper realm, like a paid realm. That people could log into at any time. It was brilliant. So the first script for the game was the... Decadent of one, what? Of one of the eight of the empires returning to Tamriel with an army of dragons. Okay, I'm not hundred percent sure I understand what you mean, but uh, do go on. Descendant. Ah, that makes more sense. Uh, so the first script of the game was the descendant of one of the empires returning to Tamriel. So you're talking about the the Elder Scroll, the first Elder Scroll, the one that Serana had. Or are you talking about something completely separate to that? My brain feels a little bit numb, actually, uh, uh, at the moment. I'm not really sure why. I meant to go and get more of this. Maybe that's why. The main quest line. Okay. Wait, uh, did we already loot this? Oh, we didn't. Cool. Um, how do we get around this wall? Does the, um, does the map, like, unclear? Like, because, uh, you know, like, you clear the map so you can see it. Does it, is it, does it do a thing where, like, if you haven't been there for too long, or, like, you, or you clear too much of the other map, does it, like, make it so you can't see where you've been already? Because it feels like it does that, and it's really annoying. But it may just be my perception. Perception gets messed around, especially in areas like this. One of the older emperors left Tamriel to go conquer another continent, but died. Okay. Cool. Uh, the lore in this game is crazy. It's it's so involved, and it's definitely I like the way that it presents it a lot more because I got really uh, I got really annoyed with Dark Souls three when I was watching because I've, ne I've never like, I've never you guys all know I've never played a Dark Souls game I almost certainly never will, um, but I've seen Dark Souls three played uh, in its entirety a hundred percent I think well I'm not sure if it was hundred percent but it was all bosses including the DLC, um, and I really don't like the way that that game like presents its lore because it, it is actually quite hard to keep track of unless you really like look hard right here we are beyond death we've completed the mission i'm kind of hoping that serana will be around to speak to you now i'd look hard see i'm not really in for that i i mean i don't want it to be like just fed to me on a plate but i also don't want to have to like search out this the story I prefer it because this. Like, I prefer it to be like paced, paced out. You know, like kind of like this is to a certain degree. Um, does it bother you that we're working against your father? Let's actually ask her that. That's quite an interesting uh, question. I can't say it surprises me. I kind of figured we were heading for this someday. I just didn't know when. It'll be hard for you. Will it be hard for you if you have to kill him? If I've been assuming that's where all this is going. I've been trying to make my peace with it. Come on, we can talk about this another time. Okay. Dexian said something about that scroll. What was it? Who's Dexian? Do with dragons, I think. Maybe we should try asking at the College of Winterhold. Sounds like something they'd know about. Okay. Well, we will do that, but we're going to do uh, another side mission first, I think. Ooh, oh, that music is. Uh... Wait, is that? Is this new stuff? Or is this stuff that we just forgot to take before? 
Do we have anything we can disenchant just out of interest? The Moth Priest. Is he the same Moth Priest that we've spoken to you before? The, the one that we saved? Yeah, oh, okay. All right, cool. Um, right, uh, let's go outside for a start. I really enjoyed um, that area, actually. That was a lot of fun. Um, but yeah, it's definitely time to move on. I just kind of hope that we go back there sometime, I think. But we'll see. Uh, I mean, like I said earlier, the game seems to think that we're not going back there, but that's not necessarily... Um, that, that's not necessarily, um, you know, the case. Um, right. So we're back to that one. But what I wanted to do is... Um... Oh, where was the one that I was looking for? It's the one where um, that, um, like, ball thing talked to us. That's the one. Merida's Beacon. Right, let's do that. Right. So, uh, that's where we need to go. The next Elder Scroll you need is in the scariest place ever. Well, we're almost certainly going to end up going there um, before the end of the stream. But, go back to Solitude. This is not even that far away from here. We'll go from Dragon's Breach or wherever it's called. Dragon's Bridge, Dragon's Breach. Uh, we're going to do this side mission first. It's also a part of the main quest, so uh, it'll be a uh, so it'll be a nice skip. What's part of the main quest? This side mission that we're doing, or I don't know. Anyway, um, I don't know what we should do. No, okay, good. Hello. Keep walking, Fuck off. Hail companion. It's a nice weapon you get. Another quiet day. I hope if those white run got. Disrespect the law and you disrespect me. I'm telling you, I watch the sky. Another quiet. What is it? Is that? Gotta keep my. You like me? Everything all right? What is it? What do you need? Staying safe? Trouble? Hands to you? I mostly. Where do you come from? Oh, Christ. Well, I'm just gonna stand here because if I fight back, then I'm gonna get attacked. Don't die, Serana. <laughs> all I wanted was for the guard to say the arrow to the knee line. That's all I wanted. Vampire attacks, literally. Right. Excuse me, sir. Intending to your hounds? You smell like a wet dog. Another quiet day. Another quiet. I have to wonder. I used to be an adventurer like you. And I took an arrow in the knee. <laughs> Thank you. That's all I wanted. Right, let's go. <laughs> uh, this game, man. I reckon that um, basically in all of in Skyrim, like pretty much all of the guards, the city guards, must have like magnetic knee ca kneecaps. They must do. It's the only way. That, that's the only thing that explains why so many of them get shot in the uh, in the knee. Is this the right way? Yeah, looks like it. Well. In the old times, it means marriage. I will arrow to the knee. That's dumb. <laughs> That's dumb. They call it what the ball and chain, don't they, these days? My temple lying in ruins. So much for the constancy of mortals, their crafts and their hearts. If they love me not, how can my love reach them? Oh my lord. Don't ask that question, Ms. Deja Lady. It is your 
destiny. Ooh, I'm flying! I'm flying! Woo! It is time for my splendor to return to Skyrim. Ah, this is amazing. But the token of my truth lies buried in the ruins of my once great temple. Now tainted by a profane darkness skittering within. Look at this. Oh, it defiles my shrine with vile corruptions, trapping lost souls left in the wake of this war to do his bidding. This is cool. Worse still, he uses the power stored within my own token to fuel his foul deeds. Wait, what's wrong with that? That is not... You're not seeing everything. That is zoomed in. Oh, I bet I know why. Oh, I really hate this game, man. You're going to watch that one video after stream. What video? The one that Smokey um, requested. I'm going to watch it um, in tea time, which should actually be any minute now. Yeah, yeah, I should be watching it super soon. Tell me about this artifact. Uh, it doesn't really sound like I have a choice in the matter. All right. That sounds cool. Forged in a holy light that breaks upon my foes, burning away corruption and false life. If you want to request a video, use the re redemptions and I'll watch it during tea time. Destroy Malcarin and retrieve this mighty blade. Mighty blade sounds good. As long as I get to keep it. Of course you will. I have commanded. Oh, dry up, Merida. Dodge this. The artifact must be reclaimed and Malkarin destroyed. Malkarin has forced the door shut. <laughs> it's my temple and it responds to my decree. Thank you very much for the, uh, <laughs> for, the for the um redemption. We'll watch it very soon. Please let me fly. I want to be able to fly like this. This is amazing. Ah, oh, you're sending me back down, but that was so nice. Ah, oh, that was amazing. I really, I really appreciated that that little video. I love the fact it took us up and like the draw distance and everything. I really hope. I really hope that we get to be able to fly at some point during this game. I suspect we can't. Uh, I genuinely don't know. Right, um, that... Avoid these types of ruins. I I see why now. Wait, did you, like, d did you go up there with me? Do you know what happened, or... Did you just see me fly up into the air and then come back down? Like, how does this work with you? Anyway, um... I don't think there's anything we can do here right now. That was awesome. I really, I really enjoyed that. But, um, what's the next part of the quest? She watched you fall away, that's really dumb. <laughs> Would she not have been like, p panicking, being like, Mella, Mella, oh no, he's gonna die, or something, I don't know. I'd be like, well, my boss is gone. <laughs> Am I her boss? Is that, I thought, I thought we were going out. Ah! Ah, now this is gonna be, a, right, this is gonna be a dungeon, right. I'm looking forward to this. Right. Look, what is this? I'm expecting traps, to be honest, and many monsters. What's this black stuff as well? Oh, that's got a decent amount of gold for one corpse. Desecrated corpse. Now, see, that makes me think maybe we might be in an area that's going to be too hard for us. Uh, just purely because it's giving us a lot of gold, but I don't know. Maybe my uh, my game logic is being too strong. Adept. We might not be able to open this either. Uh, let's see. We could do with upping our lockpicking, to be honest, but I don't know, man. 
Aha! Oh, we got so close. There we go. That's not so bad. Final boss is a little tough. But being ranged and having strong follower, you should be fine. Okay, wicked. Thank you. What did they even do? Move out of the way, Serana. Oh my god, literally. Right, okay. I'm a bit scared. Well, hold on. Um, let's... Oh, we've already got Night Eye selected. Um, cool. What are you doing? You're <laughs> just randomly stretching. Okay. Let's check the map. Okay. All right. I think I'm cool. Let's do the sneaky sneak. Wait, what's this? I think this both they, these both go around to the same place, don't they? Ah, oh, this looks cool, but I'm definitely going to get attacked here. I feel it. Oh, the ambience is scary. Is that a mob? Nope. It's always better to be safe than sorry. Oh, it might be a gargoyle. Oh, no, it's not. It's just a... What is this? This is like Din um, Durin's tomb with the light coming from it. Oh, shit. I, 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 oh, 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 oh. I'm expecting to be attacked any second now. This is kind of cool, though. I do like this. Hmm... Please don't suddenly attack me. I'm going to jump out of my skin probably when I get attacked. Now, gargoyles don't exist in most of the dungeons. So, um, oh, right, okay. So the gargoyles are just that... Um, right, that's, that's actually good to know. Gargoyles are kind of annoying because you can't sneak up on them. Wait, is that... Wait, what is that? Corrupted Shade, definitely an enemy. Definitely a dead enemy. But there is another one coming. Don't, don't. Oh, I got that guy right in the head. Get out of the way, Serana. Can you not see the guy right behind you that's about to stab you in the back? <laughs> Dude. Ah, oh, your AI is a little bit shit. <laughs> it doesn't matter. It's dead. I dealt with it. You're welcome. Uh, they're powerful allies uh, as a vampire. I bet they are, but as enemies, they're annoying as shit. Ah, okay. Right, what have we got here? Okay. This does look pretty cool, to be fair. Right, I think we need to go up the other side. Wait, what? Is this a door? Right, let's check the door. Oh, this requires a key. Okay. Can't be pick locked, apparently. Lock picked, I should say. Uh, so we require a key. We'll look for a key. If we get, if we find a key, we'll come back here. Oh, what well, we got here? Linen wrap? No. We'll take the soul gem. Plate? Book? No. I don't see any keys, do you? Unless it's in the urn. That's empty. No, apparently not. We may have to come back, but actually, hold on. Maybe the key's through here. Can't open it. I would kind of expect to be able to destroy that for some reason. Maybe not. Okay. Hmm. Is there no way in here then? Okay. Maybe we'll have to come back. Mm. Or maybe maybe we have to do the soul thing, uh, the, the light thing, and then go up there. I mean, it obviously opens the way forward, but let's see. Oh, why didn't you jump? Jump, man. Are you ready? 
There we go. Right. Is there no way across here at all? None. Wait a minute. What, what's over there? It looks like there might be something on the other side. I don't think I can get up there though. Can I? Oh, maybe I can actually if I jump on the uh, wardrobe. Ah. Oh. Let me try that one more time. Aha! Oh, come on now. Are you telling me I can't get through that after all that? Dick. Ah, uh, well, we tried. Right, let's continue. Ah, oh, no, here we go with freaking spooders. Can I do something with that? Wait, what the hell? Okay, now I am slightly confused. It looks like that should be the way forward, but we've already discovered that we can't go that way, haven't we? Unless I'm mistaken. Hmm. There's nothing in here. Right, let's try go this way again. Right, so it was... Ah, hold on. I don't think it is actually this way. I think we need to go down and then that way. It's this way. It's the way forward. Right in the shoulder blade. We should be able to just about get him before he gets to us. Oh no, he needs one more shot. There we go. He still managed to get him before he got to us. <laughs> Only because he faffed the belt though. What? What's a boot? Um. Hmm. Hmm. Rune book. Actually, quite hard to see. Maybe I should use uh Helps a tiny bit. Not very much, though. It turns everything a really weird colour. Right, we're obviously supposed to go through here. I was so expecting to be, like, attacked straight through the door. Oh, something's going to get us. I think T's coming up the... Stairs. I mean, obviously not in his own. That'd be amazing. Yeah, it's tea time, chat. Right, time to save and quit. Just a few moments. Just don't do it. Uh, I have a 1981 Jaguar XJ12. Cool. I have nothing that's that cool. Um. Right. Okay, we're back in the game. Everything's good. That was fun, though. We really enjoyed tea time, I feel. Oh no, L4, stupid indestructible. Um, I mean, maybe. I, I, I actually struggle to believe that just purely because the Renault I had was such a piece. But I mean, obviously, it uh, um, it depends on the make and model, like you say. Because I know that, generally speaking, um, like, Japanese cars are normally quite reliable. But I know that there was, like, I think Suzuki Swift have really bad rep for just going wrong all the time. I think. Or at least they did when I first learned how to drive. Because it was something I was initially looking at as my first car. And then um, the, like the reviews that we read on it were like, don't buy this car. It just goes wrong all the time. Uh, what's in this direction then? This, what is this? Iron door. Let's see what's behind the iron door. There's normally something good behind locked doors, to be fair. So let's have a look. Oh, that was close. That was silly close. Fears to be avoided too. <laughs> Seems legit. Um, I don't know what I'm doing here. I don't even know what that did, if I'm 100% honest. I think I need to open this. This. 
Ah, maybe that's what that did. But no, driving games, uh, driving games can be quite a good fun. I, re I really enjoyed Scars, but I mean, that is old school now. That's N64 era. And it wasn't just a driving game. It was kind of like cutesy and you could get like power-ups. I mean, I suppose it was like... It wasn't quite on the same level as like Mario Kart, but it was kind of halfway there, if you know what I mean. I don't know if anyone knows what I mean, the game I'm talking about. Scars. I don't know what it was called. I think it was an acronym, because I think that there was dots between the letters. Hmm. I'm not sure. Kill... Right, okay. Do let me know if anything sounds weird or looks weird, by the way. It's kind of hard to tell sometimes. Never heard of it. It wasn't very well known. I think I borrowed it off a mate, actually. What did you say? Oh, mate, that's cool. It's like the beacons of Minas Tirith. <laughs> I'm on Din. I'm, I'm such a nerd, by, by the way. I mean, if you hadn't already noticed. <laughs> I love Lord of the Rings. I love Harry Potter. I love um, James Bond. All, all of the nerd stuff, basically. I'm big on the lore of most of those things as well. I've read Harry Potter multiple times. I've, I've read Lord of the Rings twice in its entirety. I've watched the films like ridiculous number of times. Expert, we may not be able to open this, but I'm going to have a go. Well, that actually wasn't bad. I, I'm a nerd and I'm proud. Oh my god. I'm slightly surprised. Ooh, well, hello there. And we've leveled up as well. In Ah, oh, this is a good day. Elven Shield of Shock Shapash. Let's have a look at this, shall we? Right. Some nice finds there. Yeah, definitely. I'm liking the look of this shield. Let's have a look. Hold on. It's not. Oh, I don't know, actually. It's not. I mean, it's worth a lot of gold. It's also very light. I think I might go for that. I mean, it is less. Armor, but not much less armor. What do you guys reckon? Should we go for? Should we go for the elven uh, shield or the steel shield? I'll I'll, uh, I'll let you guys uh, vote in chat. What do you reckon, Arctic? Anybody want to... What was the question? Um, look at these uh, two shields. Uh, so we've got the steel shield there. St stick to shield, steel, I say. Sorry, Days, that's all right. We've got the steel shield. With weight 12. And um, we've got the elven shield, which is worth a lot of gold. It's six less armor, but it's only four weight. So what do you reckon? Steel shield or elven shield, Arctic? I'm also... I'm definitely... Sell it. Keep the steel shield. All right. Well, uh, as it's uh, both of you have said that, I'll definitely take that advice. Fair enough. Thank you guys so much for uh, your input. I genuinely appreciate it. Right. So we're going back into the ruins. So far, I'm loving this quest, by the way. feel like we should uh, sneak... Uh, I can hit almost. I think. Oh, that looks interesting. That looks like a like a, a rat run. That you let you, uh, something that you get your um like your rat or your gerbil to crawl through. Oh, I can sit on the throne. What is the use of actually being able to do that? I mean, it's cool. Bow to me, wench. How do I get off the throne? <laughs> um, I mean, I spent too long fucking around to be honest on the throne, really, didn't I? And now I, I let them sneak up on me because I'm a, a I'm a noob like that. But let's um let's get the unrelenting force out and we'll uh we'll shout. Should be long enough to uh, deal some serious damage. There you go. I'm happy with that. Right, where's their remains so that I can? Uh... All right, that's crap. Is there more? All right, we killed everything by the looks of it. Right, there's another one of those things that we need to activate up there. Hmm. 
I'm guessing we need to go through here. Requires a key, so we do. I think we have to find a key now, but it looks like there's a puzzle in this room that we can solve in order to maybe get one. I see you only need the fuss, you don't need the ra, uh, ra row. I didn't mean to pick that up to be honest, but whatever. Uh, empty, empty. Ooh, I don't want the plate, but I want the gold. Ah, uh, let's take the plate anyway. There's probably gold underneath. Oh, there actually isn't this time. There was last time. What is that? Hmm. The gold that we're getting from this is not half bad. Not half bad. What is that on the plate? That looks disgusting. Whatever that is. Okay. Right. Uh, I definitely think we want to go up there. If we can. Who's there? Yeah. Uh-oh. Who are you fighting, Serena? Serana? Whatever your name is. Oh, hello. You you just stand there, Corrupted Shade. You just stand there and get munched. <laughs> Amazing. Right, how do we get up there? Ah, there's a way up here. Right, let's do it. Okay, this looks good. Activate the pedestal. Now, what's this going to do? Then what? I mean, I'm guessing it's supposed to go all the way around the room, maybe? And I wonder if maybe... I think, yeah, we have to go around like that, I guess. Right, let's uh, let's do that then. Is it... Where's the entrance, though? Is it... Hmm. Hmm. Maybe it might be on the ground floor. Oh, no, this is it. Right. Right. Uh, oh, hello. Ah, <laughs> oh, nice one, Serena. That was nice. Hmm. Let's see if these urns have anything in them. Nope. Empty. 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 That one's got something in it. Not much, but I'll take it. Chest. Targets have improved combat sp um, skills. Health and stamina for 10 minutes. Oh, only for 10 minutes. Shame. Better than nothing, though, for sure. Oh, my lord. Are they a regular thing, or... Oh, is it the tripwire that I just stepped on? Okay. Well, as long as it's only the tripwire... Okay, I don't know what that did, but this is the rat run thing that I kind of uh, I was aiming for, so I'm glad I'm here. Okay, now I'm guessing we need to go across there, but let's have a quick look to see what else is about. Hmm, what's that door? Right, let's let's do this thing first. Wait, why why can't I jump? I'm stuck now. Great. I'm going to have to go all the way around now, won't I? Oh, I just made it out. Phew. That was close. Right. We need to obviously go up there. But is there anything that I can get from here? I definitely can't make that jump. So let's have a look around. There's that. Oh, uh, it's just the way around. Okay. <laughs> What? <laughs> nice money, though. I love how she just, like, went around. <laughs> it was so funny. Like, I went, it looked like I, I took the uh, the difficult route, and she was just like, oh, go this way. Right. Uh, what have we got? In lives and stuff. Okay. Alright. Can you... Oh, get out of the way! Honestly. Thank you. Um, it's this way, I guess. Can we just check the map as well? I mean, this isn't our final um, uh, destination. But I'm guessing this is the way to the key that we need. I'm just looking for some more of those rope traps. 
Oh, yes. Execution, baby. Wait, what? That was weird. It went for an execution and then I seemed to miss. That was really weird. Okay. I didn't even know that executions could miss. Thunderstorm and tornado warning in my air. Oh, no. How, like, how imminent is that? Like, is it going to happen, like, right now? Or have you got, like, a few hours? Or, like, how long do you get on the warning? Yeah. Did you know that there's actually... Um, I found this out uh, really recently. There's actually more tornadoes in the UK than in the USA. It's just that they're really small and nobody notices them. Whereas the tornadoes uh, in the USA that you're talking about are scary as shit. Oh... Idiot, Mallow. I should have known that was going to happen. I mean, it's not the end of the world. It didn't hurt me very much, but still. I should really have known that was going to happen. Dunno. Damn. Well, hopefully you're okay. I wish you the best as always, my friend. Right, I guess it's this way. Hmm, okay. Right. Oh, wait. Uh, have we not been here already? Oh, it just looks similar to somewhere we've been already. It's not the same. Ah, oh, ah, oh, that's the room that we were in before, isn't it? We're going around, but then we'll be able to... You know what? I'm going to piss all over you. That was from Terraria. There's an item, uh, there's a weapon in Terraria called the um, Golden Shower. And it makes it look like you're peeing everywhere. That was, uh, that was a, a, a day of hilarity when we uh, when we made that weapon. Wait, what does that even do? Does that open? Ah, oh, that opens the door that we're trying to go to. I oh, God, I know, right? I think it's, um, it's either a, a crimson, I think it's a crimson only weapon. Because I literally went to another world in order to build it. Can we jump down here without dying? Because I'm a bit scared. Should we see if we can? We can. Uh, we should probably heal quickly, though. We got a lot of quotes from that particular day. I and me put quite a lot of them in, actually. If you're still there, I and me, do you remember that? That was a lot of fun. That was a fun stream. That was a long time ago. That was back on my old, old schedule when I used to quite, re well, re not on a regular basis, but I sort of like maybe once a month I'd stream for like eight hours on a Saturday. But it wasn't like a regular thing, it was just when I could. I prefer having a regular schedule. I um, For the longest time I didn't have a regular schedule streaming. And it was a, it was a little bit frustrating sometimes. I prefer to, I prefer to have as regular as possible hours. I mean, it, it even annoys me now. Uh, I mean, it's nice to be able to stream every Thursday, but having slightly different hours. But there's literally nothing I can do to avoid that. So it's just what has to happen, unfortunately. But no, it's it's not too bad. I mean, it's nice to be able to say I stream every Thursday, which of course is going to be every Friday so coming up soon. So I'm stream I'm changing my stream day. Not next next Thursday. I'm streaming, still streaming, but next Thursday will be my last Thursday stream. Ah, oh, I should have ducked for that shot. Wow, there's quite a lot there, isn't there? I actually have an idea. One thing that we haven't done for a long time. Come on, before they reach me. Come on, hurry up, Mella. No, I don't. Am I still shooting with my bow and arrow? Because that's stupid. There we go. That's what I wanted to do. I haven't used this form for absolutely ages. Wait, did I die? Did I just get absolutely butt munched? I did. Mate. 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 I got wrecked. Sheesh, we're nearly at 60 deaths as well. Rip, exactly, exactly. <laughs> right, hold on. 
Now, I think I want to... Right. Let me entertain you. Uh, I'm going to get beast form ready straight away. I'm going to do, like, one shot. And then I'm going to go straight for beast form and see where it gets me. Right. Come on, Mela. You need to transform quicker than that. Why have you still... What are you doing? Oh, this would be so much easier if the fucking controls are better. Right. I think we've got the, the hang of this now, hopefully. I need to keep an eye on my health, though. Right, hold on. Oh, right, I can't heal, can I? Shit. I'm gonna die. Maybe uh, that form isn't the best idea then. <laughs> Shit. Right, I think we're gonna try a different... Uh, a, a different tactic, because that didn't work. I mean, it would have been better if I'd uh, been able to put my stupid crossbow away instead of turning it into a werewolf and then randomly shooting my crossbow, which I'm a bit annoyed about, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, fine. Let's see how this works. As I accidentally activated the... Uh... Yeah, see, this is not working. Nope. <laughs> well, at least there's number 60. Jesus Christ. Okay, right. Let's try that again, shall we? Uh, except, let's try and do a little bit better. Uh, we'll put Unrelenting Force on our Z key. And uh, let's see what happens. Tornado's coming. Shit. Uh, well, if you need to get away, dude, just don't worry about it. Make sure you're safe. That's the most important thing. I actually didn't mean to do that. Step forward, Serena. I want you to block the door if you can. Right, hold on. Hopefully I'm going to have enough time to do this. Oh, what? What even killed me? Whatever killed me, killed me... Um, like, took half of my health in one hit. That was ridiculous. Right. I think it was the boss, to be honest. Get up! Of I'm pressing the button. Get up, you douche nozzle. Right. Oh, okay, hold on. Hold your fucking horses, guys. Right. Right. Oh, is that the boss? Oh, shit, man. Right, I need more healing. I should have some potions of major healing. If you go for caster, shadows don't deal that much damage to you. Okay, well, um, I haven't gone caster. I've gone for, like, sneaky sneak long range. Uh, potion of vigorous healing. Wait, what do they even do? Um, not quite as much as I was hoping. Oh my, no! I was just about, to, I literally hit the tab button to do some healing. Oh, that's frustrating. <sighs> Dick. Whoosh, bro. 
I think I badly timed that um, shout, to be fair. Right. Um, let's... No, I didn't want a uh, shout. Well, magic, I wanted items. Right, let's uh, drink some of those. Let's do that one. The dart. Oh, fuck you! Oh, this guy's annoying. Uh, the dart has a lot more crowd control. I haven't got the, the die yet. I've just got Fuss and Roo. Unfortunately. Maybe I should kill the ads. What? Whoa, I moved on my own then. I think that might have been Serana that did that. This guy is annoying the shit out of me, if I'm honest. Right, hold on. Now, Biatch, if you kill me now, I'm going to be very angry. Uh, potions. Right. Um, I think we'll keep them and do the minor ones. Just purely because it'll get rid of slightly more weight from our pack. Right. Take that, bitch. <laughs> oh, Jesus. He's not dead. The shade, his shade now lives. Yes, that's right, Mr. Shade. You die as well. It is now. The defiler is defeated. Take Dawnbreaker from its pedestal. Don't mind if I do. Oof. Uh, I'll definitely take the uh, enchanted thing. Yay, we did it! Woo! Victory sip. Right. What else? Was there any more remains that we can uh, defile? No. Well, I'm glad that we defeated that boss. It was more annoying than anything else, but it was kind of fun as well. I'm also liking all this gold. I would quite like to buy um, the house at some point, or maybe the plot of land, I'm not sure. Part of me kind of wants to buy the house in uh, Whiterun, purely because I kind of feel like Whiterun's kind of our home. But at the same time, I've heard that there's like plots of land that you can buy. I think there's one in Falkreath uh, that is like more fun, so I don't know. Is there anything else? Uh, We'll see. Ooh, a hundred gold. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you spoil me. Gonna have to leave you there. Have a good stream. Cheers for uh, popping by. Have a good one. I'm sure I'll see you very soon. In the meantime, though, have a uh, have a nice uh, evening, mate. Uh, I think we're done. Is it gonna teleport us straight out, or do we have to make our way out, or? Weapons used by the Dawn Guard do extra damage when attacking vampires. Well, we are in the Dawn Guard, so that's good. Oh, we're back up here again. Oh, look, look, this looks so good. Look, look how cool this looks. Looks better in day, though. This is as it should be. 
This is because of you. Okay. A new day is dawning, and you shall be its herald. Take the mighty Dawnbreaker, and with it purge corruption from the dark corners of the world. Wield it. I hope it's not a two-handed weapon. My influence may grow. I'll be sad if it's a two-hander. May the light of certitude guide your efforts. The Break of Dawn. So you're back where you should be, right? And we still can't do anything with it. Alright. Well, um, let me see this weapon. Uh, Dawnbreaker. It's going to be a two-hander, isn't it? Let me just wield it for a second. Oh, no, it's not. Nice. What's the thing at the bottom? How do I activate? Because there's obviously there's a bar at the bottom there. It means I'm guessing I can do something. E? I don't know. That could be quite a cool weapon. Let me just double check a few things. Um, right, there's my normal weapon. Dawnbreaker, it only does two more damage. But. It needs to go. I'm going to. Uh, I'm definitely going to equip it if it's. Uh, that's my favourite. Right. And that needs to go at number one. Crossbow is number two. Number one. There we go. Uh, it's obviously it looks like it's got some sort of extra thing that it does, but I don't know what that is. But uh, we'll figure it out. Right, that was fun. Um, I enjoyed that little uh, side mission. Alrighty. I think we're going to call it there. Um, what do you reckon, Arctic? What are you saying? Why are Well, uh, uh, the camera's still gone. Oh, uh, yeah, I took the camera off. Just so you could see it. Just for reminding me, actually, I forgot. What do you reckon? Um, I feel like maybe ca um, calling it there, but, I mean, we could continue. Did you yes, we got the sword. And it does two more dungeons. How do I do... It's, like, the sword... The sword did have a thing, like a bar at the bottom that I could do, but it's gone now. Like, is there any special things that this sword does? If so, how do I activate it? Do you know? I like the look of it, though. It's cool. Hmm. If you want to use two weapons, left click and right click. Um, what instead of a sh I quite like wielding a shield, to be fair. Should we go back to um, town? What is that? Custom destination. Shield, I think, is better. Yeah, I quite like having a shield. It's really useful. Can I get rid of the custom destination, please? Honestly. Um, right, I want to go back to White Run. Where the fuck is White Run from here? Orchestra, it should be over here somewhere. There it is. Right, good times. We're going to uh, sell some bits and pieces. I might go back to Dawnguard HQ actually, um, to, uh, but let me have a quick look around here first. I mean, it would be pretty good to like start and end in the Dawnguard HQ, especially as we're kind of focusing on that DLC at the moment. Ugh, why is it always closed?
Right. What do you need, my friend? Um, what have you got for sale? So you're an alchemist then. And then let's see what we can actually sell to you. Although, that's dragon bone and the skull. I don't know why I picked up the skulls, to be honest. I'll keep the ingredients. Come back. Yeah, thanks. Right. Um, what time is it? Right, it needs to be like 10 or 11, so we'll wait for three, three hours. I don't know why he opens so late. Still. Really? Get that gold. What gold? What do you mean? You must be open. Oh, for fu Really? Why is he not open at one in the afternoon? This guy, that like, I'm surprised he makes any money. Give a Everything's for sale, my trinkets, odds and ends. Trinkets. Sort of thing. Right, let's have a look. Right, we can definitely get rid of our old sword. Right, that's not even the old sword. Um, that's the old sword. Um, what else can we get? Um, that's a load of crap, to be honest. Um, what else? I thought we got more than that. Uh, oh, there was apparel that we got as well. Um, the Dwarven Shield. Oh, we, I didn't even know that we picked up a Dwarven Shield. I don't think it's very good though. 209. It's, yeah, hold on. It's the same armor rating. Weight 12. It's literally exactly the same. Uh, you can have that. Um, you can have that. All this gold is pretty nice. Uh, you're nearly out of gold now. Um, I think we'll disenchant the Necromancer's robes, though. We may as well, because it's not really worth very much. Uh, oh, also, just while I'm here. I should have checked, um, yeah. Um, let's check your potions. Uh, not great. Uh, we'll quickly check the cauldron as well for potions as well. And I think that probably that probably do us actually. I don't think we need to go back to the Dawnguard HQ. Give a holler. Could be a taxia. It's quite a problem back home in uh, Bit rude. Uh, uh, thank you. So you're an alchemist then. Um. Du -du -du. Ha ha. Don't mind if I do. Quite expensive, but probably worth it. Okay, thank you. Uh, what else do we need? I think that's probably going to be enough for us. All right, I'm going to call. Uh, I'm going to call it a stream there. Um, we're going to uh, go raid someone though, so don't go anywhere. Uh, let's. And um, we've got some thank yous to say. Uh, can you bear with me. The sound also goes bloody awful whenever I uh, enter or exit the game. There's nothing I can do about that. It's kind of uh, the game's fault. It's kind of my sound card, uh, video card. You get the idea. Right. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. I really hope you've enjoyed the stream. I certainly have. Uh, Skyrim is a fantastic game. We are going to be trying to playing Skyrim again next week. Late stream, uh, 10 o'clock UK time PM uh, until 2 a.m. Uh, as I'm on a late shift next week, so come along to that. Uh, it's still time to follow me uh, if you want your name. I don't like this music. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna change that between streams to something just a little bit less like. Blah, 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 blah. I still want it to be metal, just maybe not quite as heavy as this. Uh, also, um, very special thanks to uh, Smokey. Cheers for uh, the host. Stampy, cheers for the follow. Uh, Matt, thank you for the cheeky little biddies, and Arctic, thank you so much for the resub at the beginning of the uh, stream. That's really cool of you, dude. I uh, seriously, I really appreciate you being around uh, and the resub and everything. You're absolutely amazing, dude. Uh, there really is only one person that we like that even makes even the slightest amount of raids today, and that is Moonlit Shadows. She's amazing. Uh, 
she it's her birthday go and give her loads of birthday wishes if you haven't already uh, i absolutely love her she plays all the games that i love she plays pokemon uh zelda um especially ocarina of time i'm going to be playing a multi-world with her next weekend uh, no sorry next wednesday on her channel not i'm not going to be streaming that and i'm going to be live next the day after tomorrow saturday 12 o'clock uk time in the afternoon until six so six hour stream of final fantasy 10 2 so come along for that that's going to be our last saturday stream so final fantasy 10 2 is going to have to be switched to another day don't know how that's going to work but we will figure that out so guys 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 thank you so much for joining me today i hope you've enjoyed it you guys are amazing my name is Mella, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye for now.